We've all been worried about robots taking our jobs. Humanoids sweeping city streets, automated arms, mixing drinks behind coffee bars, machines replacing human hands, one manual task at a time. But that's not where the real disruption is happening. The robots that are coming for our jobs are not made of metal or circuits. We can see they don't walk on two legs or speak in monotone, and they don't show up on factory floors or in, in delivery vans. They're already here inside our laptops, descending from the clouds like spirits from another world, silent, invisible, and incomprehensibly fast. These are the robots we do not see, the ones taking our most valuable work, not metal arms, but with lightning fast logic and precision beyond anything we imagined. They don't replace labor, they replace leverage. They're not replacing just workers, they're replacing workflows. They automate thought, judgment, and decision making. They handle research, craft communications, build strategies, and execute tasks once reserved for highly trained professionals. And they do it with a level of precision and scale that human beings simply cannot match. This isn't the future of work. This is the present. Unfolding quietly across industries and sectors, these AI agents aren't coming, they're already here. We've moved beyond AI assistants that simply suggest, and now we're entering a phase where AI acts. Agents are autonomous software programs designed to execute multi-step tasks, often without direct supervision. They observe, plan, and take action. Think of it like this. AI co-pilots help you fly a plane. Agents fly the plane for you. In this video, we're exploring how these agents are quietly transforming every major industry from marketing and video production to healthcare, agriculture, and logistics by plugging directly into the tools we already use. If you're a founder, investor, or operator, or just trying to understand where the next wave of automation is coming from, you'll definitely want to stick around. So subscribe if you haven't already, because in this series, we're not just mapping the agents, we're showing you who's building them, how they work, and why they might just be the next layer of the internet. In 2023, over $4 billion was invested into startups building AI agents. The term AI agent appeared in over 40% of tech company earning calls. And in less than 12 months, the number of deployed autonomous agents has doubled across sectors like healthcare, marketing, and logistics. This isn't just a trend, it's a transformation. Over 1,000 high-functioning agents are now quietly powering our digital infrastructure, making decisions, automating workflows, and doing what once required teams of people. This is the rise of the digital worker. AI agents are not just productivity tools, they're emerging coworkers integrated into daily workflows, often acting behind the scenes. The growth has been explosive. In 2024 alone, mentions of AI agents and earning calls quadrupled. Over half of the leading agent startups were founded after 2023. Startups are racing to take their claim. Investors are pouring in billions. Everyone wants a piece of the next productivity revolution. Why now? The infrastructure is finally here. Foundation models are powerful enough, APIs are abundant, and the market demand, sky high. We're no longer asking if AI agents will change how we work. The only question now is, how fast and how far will they go? Now behind every AI agent is a complex ecosystem of APIs, foundation models, and orchestration tools. These are the hidden gears that let agents operate autonomously. Most agents today are powered by large language models. Think GPT-4, Claude, Gemini, Mistral. These models process instructions, make inferences, and generate human-like responses. Many agents use OpenAI's API to access GPT-4 Turbo for long context planning or Anthropic's Claude for nuanced reasoning. The model choices define an agent's personality, capabilities, and reliability. In some cases, agents switch between models in real time depending on task complexity or cost. It's not one brain, it's many, and agents do not work in isolation. They need tools, and they get them through APIs from Google Calendar and Notion to Stripe, Slack, and Zoom. APIs allow agents to send emails, schedule meetings, book services, and process transactions. This is where orchestrators like Langchain and Autogen come in. They connect models to external tools, manage memory, reasoning chains, and task completion loops. This orchestration layer is critical. Without it, you'd have a powerful brain but no hands. Let's look at a few real-world examples. Take Cognosis, a no-code agent builder that uses GTP4 for reasoning 
Langchain for task orchestration, and Pinecone for memory retrieval. Or Sierra AI, known as the customer support agent, it integrates Zendesk, Slack, and internal knowledge bases. The Brain, Cloud 3. What we're seeing is a new software pattern. Plug in your models, bring in your APIs, and let agents do the rest. Agents are not standalone apps, they're networks of intelligence powered by an ecosystem of models, APIs, and logic layers. AI agents are no longer prototypes or speculative tools. They're here, quietly embedded in our workflows, influencing how we make decisions, communicate, and even live. Now, we'll be tackling the implications. What does the rise of AI agents mean for work, regulation, power, and trust? From customer support to legal workflows, AI agents are being hired in mass. Salesforce, Shopify, and Lyft are using them to handle support, HR tasks, and logistics. These agents don't just sleep, don't call in sick, and they don't need training after deployment. This is raising a new question. What happens to the workforce when machines can autonomously perform high leverage tasks? While agents may eliminate some roles, others will evolve. New jobs in AI, supervision, prompt engineering, agent strategy and evaluation are already emerging. The power of agents brings a new class of risks, hallucinations, data leaks, compliance violations. And then who is responsible when an agent makes a mistake? Companies like Norm AI and Ganymede are building governance and compliance into agent architecture. Others like Orbi AI are pioneering human in the loop safety nets. Policymakers are watching. The EU AI Act and the US executive orders are beginning to define what safe deployment looks like, but regulation is still catching up. Let's explore the landscape of some AI agents defining the shift. Business strategy is no longer confined to boardrooms and quarterly reviews. Today, AI agents are embedded in decision-making loops, forecasting financials, generating reports, and even advising executives in real time. A prominent case in this area is Runway Financial, a tool that integrates GPT-4 with accounting and ERP systems like QuickBooks, Xero, and NetSuite through secure APIs. Its agent can generate cash flow projections, model growth scenarios, and flag anomalies in financial reports. In 2024, Superhuman Labs, an email service provider, reported a significant improvement in their financial operations after integrating Runway Financial's AI-powered tools. According to Andrew Maher, the head of finance at Superhuman Labs, the company experienced a 50 to 100 times increase in efficiency, transforming tasks that previously took hours into processes completed in seconds. This enhancement allowed for the distillation of complex financial models into clear, actionable insights, enabling rapid responses to key executives. This example shows the substantial time-saving and efficiency benefits that AI-driven financial platforms can offer to organizations seeking to optimize their financial planning and reporting processes. In a similar vein, Copy AI, a newer player, acts as a real-time strategic assistant. It pulls data from Notion, Google Analytics, Stripe, and HubSpot APIs to offer founders context-aware insights. Reporting something like, your MRR has plateaued for three weeks, would you like to test the new onboarding flow? It's not just reactive, it nudges founders towards proactive experimentation. According to Copy's team, over 30% of founder decisions using AI are now co-suggested by the agent and not by human advisors. Under the surface, these agents depend on layered integrations using tools like Zapier, Airtable automations, and OpenAI, calling to orchestrate complex data pulls and recommendations. And for analytics, many agents are calling into Looker's BI API or Power BI embedded, letting the AI interpret dashboards that would have taken teams hours to decode previously. For businesses scaling fast, AI agents are becoming decision co-pilots. At CapChase, a fintech providing non-dilutive funding, its AI agents analyze user data via custom APIs that determine funding eligibility in minutes. Before automation, underwriting took up to five days. Now, the AI trims that down to under 20 minutes while reducing error rates by nearly 35%. And the shift isn't theoretical. According to a 2024 Deloitte survey, 61% of mid-market CEOs say they now rely on AI-powered reports to guide weekly or even daily decisions. The rise of executive level agents isn't just about speed, it's about clarity in a world flooded with noise. These AI businesses don't just replace judgment, they amplify it. And in today's markets, one step ahead can be the difference between scaling or stalling. In the video generation space, AI agents are changing the way we create video. What once required large teams and days of editing, 
now takes minutes, all thanks to powerful AI models and seamless API integrations. These agents harness OpenAI, Anthropic, and other advanced tools to automate video creation, dramatically reducing both times and cost. One of the leaders in this field is Runway ML. AI-powered platform integrates GTP4 and stable diffusion for image generation while also utilizing DeepAI's API for video production. By simply inputting a text prompt, users can generate full video sequences. In 2023, Runway reported that users were able to create 10x more content through traditional editing methods, enabling more efficient production and post-production workflows. A prime example is Tool, a creative production company that collaborated with director Wes Walker on Under Armour's Forever Is Made Now video campaign featuring professional boxer Anthony Joshua. Faced with a tight production schedule and limited access to the athlete, Tool turned to Runway ML's AI-powered tools to meet their needs. To overcome the challenges of a constrained timeline and restricted access to Joshua, Tool implemented a mixed media approach that combined AI-generated content with traditional visual effects. They utilized Runway ML's text-to-image Gen 2 animations to produce thousands of still images, which were then animated and integrate it with licensed footage. Additionally, AI-driven text-to-speech technology generated voiceover, compensating for the lack of direct access to the athlete. This innovative workflow allowed Tool to complete the project in just four weeks, significantly faster than the typical five to six weeks required for such campaigns. Moreover, the use of AI tools resulted in substantial cost savings compared to traditional production methods. These video generation tools rely on a complex web of APIs to work seamlessly together. One of these text-to-video tools is Synthesis. APIs like Runways Gen 1 and DeepAI integrate GPT-4 and Claude models to generate video sequences directly from written prompts, combining text, image generation models to create visually compelling content. Sound and music integration, the script integrates Ava Technologies AI to produce background music or voiceovers. And these APIs analyze the video's mood and tone, matching audio to the visuals automatically. Editing and format optimization, Opus Clips, for instance, uses the AI agent to automatically trim, edit, and format long video clips into shorter clips optimized for platforms like Instagram and TikTok, helping creators save time without sacrificing quality. And Pika Labs takes integration even further. Pika's AI agents use OpenAI for text generation and stable diffusion for imagery, but what sets them apart is the seamless coordination of these tools with video rendering APIs. Quinn Murphy, a freelance content producer for Alicia Keys, used Runway ML's AI tools to rapidly create high sequence videos during live events, including a recent one in Miami. She leveraged features like AI powered green screen and in browser editing to meet tight deadlines without sacrificing production value. This allowed her to deliver real time content that boosted Alicia Keys' online engagement, something previously infeasible with traditional workflows. AI agents in video production are impressive. The quality control still requires attention. AI generated videos may lack the emotional intelligence and creative direction that humans provide. Moreover, the rapid evolution of AI generated content brings about ethical concerns, especially in areas like deep fakes and misinformation. As AI video becomes more powerful, platforms and creators must navigate these challenges to ensure authenticity and transparency.